prompts. Soccer and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Soccer a present? Yes. I like your fairy godfather who can teach you how to give better presents. <laughs> We're going to see who can stay in the sauna the longest. Am I right? I could eat a steaming hot bowl of soap right now. Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. I am here. I am Dan. <laughs> this is Aaron. <laughs> Hello. What an introduction. I am Thank here. <laughs> so help me God, it's all I know in this world. <laughs> oh, I'm getting a ding dong. Not a ding dong. Bing dong, oh. but a ding dong. Wow, okay. Let's see what happens. Mm, who could that be? Wondering who had come to visit, I opened the door and someone forced their way in. Oh, no. Oh, it's Toko. Oh, okay. What a strange interaction. T to Toko, yeah. what's the matter? What's How'd you force your way in with those tiny, tiny hands? <laughs> I, I stuck my finger into the lock hole. <laughs> yeah, I picked it with my fingernail. <laughs> I picked it. <laughs> Why are you so surprised? Am I really that annoying? No, we just have no relationship no, whatsoever. No one said, yeah, you just forced your way into my room. That's what's not cool. Well, I already know why I'm annoying. I came here knowing that, so that makes it okay. No, you're not annoying. God, <laughs> you're so annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just wondered what was going on. I have a, f a favor to ask. I want you to g go somewhere with me. Well, let's find out where. Hmm. And where is it you want to go? Well, to the afterlife. To the library. <laughs> the weapons room. <laughs> huh? Are you looking for a book or something? Why don't you just ask? He spends all his time in the library anyway. <laughs> Did I say something wrong? You're not a bladder mouth, right? <laughs> it has to be. This has to be a secret. I honestly have no idea what you're talking about, but if you want me to be quiet, I'll be quiet. Then let's go to the library! <laughs> then let's go to the library! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got it! The library! Jeez, why so pushy? <laughs> be quiet! Be quiet when you can go in! Don't let him see you! She actually was starting to get annoying, but I did what she said and gently crept into the library. It's almost like it's a self-fulfilling prophecy or something. Unsurprisingly, Byokya was there by himself, absorbed by a book. He's here. He's here. Oh. What, is he like a celebrity? I don't know. Stop being so loud. Just hurry up and go talk to him. You go talk to him if you want to so bad. What you do it? No, you do it. No, you do it. He's too beautiful. <laughs> They're super loud and yeah. <laughs> two inches away. Why don't you go talk to him? <laughs> I don't want to bother him. <laughs> Shh, keep it down. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Okay. Oh, he's sitting now. <laughs> yeah. You wanted to bother me? <laughs> he seems to be really focused on that book. It doesn't seem like the best time to talk to him. Ugh, but I'll this do it is not anyway. the best time to talk to me. <laughs> hey, you. Hey, you. <laughs> what are you doing back here? I hate even having to look at you. Alright. Cool. Uh, so you noticed me, huh? Thank you, senpai! <laughs> 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 Of course. Now hurry up and leave. <laughs> and take her with you. <laughs> hey, um... Be okay. <laughs> Remember how you said, don't be a woman who dominates weak men, be a woman dominated by a strong man? I never said that. Okay, well you did. Well, actually I just thought it sounded like something you, you might say. Boy, she's really weird. Get out. And go take a bath. You smell. <laughs> the Mondo and Taka busted like, FINALLY! <laughs> we'll gladly take a bath. <laughs> Don't make me say it again. Go now, before your stench latches onto the entire room. Okay. Man, that guy's jerky. Yeah. Well, what a dick! <laughs> I, to think I liked him. Jesus, alright, we'll see ya! 
He really dug into us there. Maybe he's in a bad mood, or maybe he's just an asshole. Yeah. I think if you're in a bad mood every single time someone sees you for months, <laughs> you might just be a dick. <laughs> yeah. He seems super de she seems super depressed. Did he really upset her that much? Big to go that far. He must be really concerned about me. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. He told me to take a bath and everything. He must really care about my well-being. Toko, you're drooling. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's what he meant. Hey, <laughs> Makoto, what do you think? Think about what? Do you think Bakura and I would be a good together? Well, now, I don't really know. Maybe. That that's true. There's really no way to know. But the distance between us doesn't change our love. <laughs> because as soon as you realize your feelings, the love is born. That's how love works. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> there might be come a day when you understand maybe someday. Well, bye. Um. Oh my goodness gracious. Now I need to take a bath. <laughs> yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, young love. Oh, wah. Uh. <laughs> well, wah. Uh, who would have ever guessed she would go for someone like him? But eager passion can also be scary. Sometimes that leads people off in the wrong direction. Yo ho 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 ho. Uh, <laughs> all of a sudden, I feel exhausted. Maybe I'll head back to my room for now. I'm not even. Yeah, that was a lot to take in here today. There's still some time left in the day. What to do? Ah, I have to go go time. out again. <laughs> yeah, great. <laughs> I've got plenty I think of energy. I'll go lie down. I think I'll go out. <laughs> Sounds fun! Nobody around. I'll go out while lying down. Oh, with my it's VR the headset. Only possible the way. Quest 2! I haven't seen Hifumi in a while. Yeah, see what he's up to. Maybe we have a gift for him. Oh, you know Hello? what? I have that, like, joke book or whatever that he might like. Ah, Mr. Nagy! I'm glad you came! Hmm, should I hang out with Hifumi for a while? Yeah, I guess so. I know I look like I'm all about the cutting edge, but I have a profound love for retro games, too. <laughs> Let's begin my four-part history of electronic games. Part 1, Ancient Babylonia. Hell yeah. <laughs> I listened to Hifumi's half-obsessed ranting for longer than I would have liked. And I came out an appreciator of the arts. <laughs> it was an excellent rant. <laughs> Hifumi and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give him a present? Definitely. What would you like to give him? Isn't that G sick? Oh, I bet he would like that. Oh, it's a throwaway watch. I don't think. What does that like mean? That. Like it's a, it's cheap. Oh, it's like uh, nothing, basically. Yeah, it's, a, it's like one of those like Casio. $10 yeah, yeah, yeah. Watches. got it. Um, I think that's actually what it's based on. G sick. Adorable reactions. Oh, maybe not this one. Um, what about that self-destructing cassette? You might like that. I don't That's know. Very, like, I don't know. Ooh, Moon Rock. Oh. Sure. Well, well, who else? I mean, people Maybe. are dying. Yeah. <laughs> the maiden's, the maiden's handbag. handbag. Oh. 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 Fan. Well. Mm. No, that would go to Chihiro. No, who's the fanfic writer? To Toko. This would be for Toko. Oh, okay, got it. Um. Well, shit. Well, shit. How y'all doing? I don't know, man. I don't. I don't want to give up a potentially good present for somebody else. Maybe well, I, dude, it doesn't seem like uh, you lose the presents that you give to people. You still have the whip and you still have the chin drill. No, I don't. Oh, you don't. Yeah, see, it says one for Rose, and it says zero for Rose. Ah. Uh, yeah. Never mind. Well, I don't know who else this would go to, so I'll just give it to him. Yeah, see what happens. Mm -hmm. Oh-ho! Thank you for this most wonderful item! Does that mean you liked it? No. Sounds pretty generic. Meh, I see quality in you, Mr. Nagy. True quality! Mr. Nagy! And that's why... 
I've decided to present you to my lecture. I've decided to present to you my lecture on the nature of fan fiction. Oh, delightful. Oy vey. If we're going to be friends, you must be fully informed. I will permit no fanfic bigotry whatsoever. <laughs> okay. I don't think I have any fanfic bigotry. I mean, I don't really know anything about that kind of geeky stuff anyway. See? There it is. You son of a bitch. <laughs> to you, fanfic equals geeky, right? But is that all the word that word is worth? Yeah. Wait. But it, yeah, I guess that's what he said. Huh? Did I say something wrong? But that's okay. Because I take the word geek as a compliment. Then what are you so fucking upset about? Yeah. For you see, there's nobody on earth so full of knowledge as a geek. Yes, indeed. In a sense, a geek is like an expert. That's right, a total expert. A successful musician must necessarily be a music geek. A good movie director is a movie geek. You see? I just want to like... Do the Homer Simpson thing where I like back into the bushes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's those experts, those geeks who open up the world to others. So when you say that writing fanfic is geeky, you're recognizing us as true experts. Okay, so um, what exactly is fanfic then? Oof, super direct question. What the fuck? No, for the win, <laughs> sorry. I always get that backwards. <laughs> Basically, we have all kinds of different sto- Wait, we have all different kinds of stores and events, right? Okay. These are where groups of holy warriors sell their own stuff based on games, comics, anime, everything. And the stuff those people make is fanfic? <laughs> comics are the most common creation, but it also includes games, music, and even merchandise. By the way, there's a name for when a group of fanfic creators come together. Specifically, it's any organized group that comes together to release their work. A group that comes together to release their work. Uh, a circle jerk? <laughs> is it? I don't know. What is it? I don't know. Oh, maybe like, a, maybe gonna, it is a circle. I'm going to Google it. Fanfic okay. group coming together term. Fanfic terminology. Wow. Fandom common terms. Uh, let's look at circle. See if that's a term. Cliche and circle is not a term. Okay. Menagerie? How about a menagerie? Nope. How about a square? A square? And... Nope. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> These are all made up shit. All right, so just guess one. Menagerie. Nope. Is it a menagerie? Well, I suppose on a technical linguistic level, that's true. But I'm talking about something a little more common. Listen, I'm sure you know this. Go ahead and tell me. A group that comes together to release their work. A circle. Okay. Is it a circle? <laughs> It sure is! Of course you knew that! I mean, it's only common sense. What kind of idiot would say a menagerie? <laughs> I certainly hope you don't expect me to explain such common sense topics every time. Well, like I said, I don't know too much about this stuff, nor do I care. <laughs> this goes well beyond I don't know too much! <laughs> but I guess I can't blame you. The propaganda never touches on that. So as fanfic ambassador. By the time I'm done with you, you'll be itching to buy a premium pass to the next fanfic con. Oh! Dude, you're gonna die, like, tomorrow, <laughs> yeah, probably. I know. It's, everyone's talking about, like, this is vacation or something. <laughs> right? Obviously, he's excited, but... <laughs> That's it for today. I hope you're excited for your next lesson. I can't wait to see what the future has in store for the two of us. I'm kind of scared to see what the future has in store for the two of us. Just the two of us. <laughs> Building castles in the sky! <laughs> Hifumi's report card has been updated based on your experience with him. You just unlock skill handiwork. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Great. After we were done... Checking off! I decided to head back to my room for a while. Alright. Oh, it's nighttime. I guess I'll leave during nighttime, because I do it every night now. Oh, that's a ding-dong-bing-bong. Sweet. Hello!
Hello, everybody. Ding dong, bing bong. Don't let the bed bugs bite, etc., etc. Don't go inside the thing. <laughs> oh, I'll go to the gym emergency. Oh, jeez. Gather in the gym. Why now, all of a sudden? I really don't like the sound of this. I have a terrible feeling. Yeah. Someone's going to die, baby. Someone's going to die. And you know what? It's about time. Someone oh. needs to die. What's Hello. Going on? What's going on with you, girl? Oh, Kyoko, did you hear the announcement just now? Yes. I don't want to go, but we don't have any other choice, right? I can't imagine it's going to be good news, but it's not a good idea to defy him here and now. So I'm going on ahead. Bye. I can't really do anything except what Monokuma tells me. Ha <laughs> ha, I'm being faded away. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what's up, Mondo? Yo. <laughs> hey, man, you about to head in? Yeah, everyone has... Has everyone gone on ahead? Shit. Looks that way. I don't like it, but nothing good's gonna come from ignoring that goddamn bear. Um, Mondo? Are you sure you're okay? You kinda went all out in that sauna. Huh? Who went all out? That shit doesn't even phase me. But, you know. <laughs> there at the edge of hell, a promise between men was waiting for me. Never saw it coming. Anyway, let's get our asses into the gym. Man, something unique must have happened between the two of them. I think it's beautiful. I think it's wonderful. And you know what? They should be able to express themselves. In this fucking yeah. terrible world that we live in. Just making man promises in the sauna? <laughs> man promises. <laughs> Promise of man. <laughs> Promise of man. That, that was it. <laughs> it's my promise of a man. Oh, Hifumi, I was just hey, Hi, Hifumi, we just talked to you. I Let's... feel like we can bypass you, never mind. Okay, how have you gone in yet? Who I am? Why is that? <laughs> Mr. Nay, like... don't scare me like that. Sorry, but we should really go inside. <laughs> no, don't go, you can't go. That's why my ghost friend is telling me. Okay, well, I'm gonna go in and I will yeah. see you later. <laughs> if you need me, I will be in the gym. <laughs> I don't feel good about it either, but we can't just ignore this. Damn, that's true too. I guess we have no choice. <laughs> Goodbye. I have to go All right. too. Cool, let's do it. It's time to get killed by someone. Hmm, asking us to gather together all of a sudden like this, what could he possibly want? To murder all of you. <laughs> Indeed, what might await us this time? Hmm, he keeps things interesting. That's for certain. How is that funny? Can't you smile like a normal person once in a while? Like how the housewife, how, oof, like how the housewife on a classic TV show smiles at the end of an episode? What the heck? There's something totally messed up with you if you can laugh at a time like this, you stupid bastard. Which of us is actually messed up? Hmm. Well, what's that supposed to mean? That you're messed up. <laughs> Nothing in particular, just admiring, that's all. I don't want to kill anyone, but I also don't want to stay here, living in blind denial day after day. I was just admiring how you could live like that and still keep your sanity. What is this? I am not in denial, first of all. <laughs> that reminds me, remember how you kept talking about how the police or whoever would come help us? How'd that turn out? It seems to me there's no sign whatsoever of a possible rescue. Well, that, that's just... Huh? I wonder what actually happened. Certainly. It's strange, that's true. There's no way the police would know about it. We're right in the middle of a major urban area. The police suck! <laughs> oh, damn. Wow, jeez, Hifumi. On the contrary, the mastermind may be just that powerful to take control even of the police. Could it be? Uh, this may not be related, but... <laughs> I got a shit bad. Yeah. <laughs> then don't say it! Mm. Nope, gonna say it. It's, like <laughs> it's about last night. I was near the main hall, just staring off into space. Mm -hmm. When all of a sudden, I heard it. Huh? A toot? <laughs> a sound that I don't really know what it was. A toot? What kind of sound? Mm. I just said I don't really know what it was. <laughs> yeah. Well, like I said, I don't really know. But if I had to describe it, it, it would be exactly like this. <laughs> it was... A construction site, I guess. A construction site? I mean, I could just be making that up, bro. I just barely heard anything. 
then you d d d d d d d d definitely m m m m m made it up. Must have just been sound of the ocean in that head of yours. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Say what? What you talking about, Toko? What is uh -oh. happening? Plot, plot, plot. <laughs> okay. Gooey. He's arrived. What Hero heard wasn't the sound of construction, but it could have been an explosion! <laughs> huh? I may be a machine gun. <laughs> that can kind of sound like construction in a way. What are you talking about? Ah, ah, ah! Beyond this point, my mouth is zipped. My lips are sealed. I am fully puckered. <laughs> it's your secret, little secret. And? <laughs> All right, Fine, then, then let's move secrets. on to what you can tell us. <laughs> Why did you call us all here? You don't beat around the old bush, do you? Ready for me to get to the point, huh? But before that, you mind if I vent a little? Hmm. I'm low on energy these days. My stitching's even losing all its shine and luster. I'm thinking it's probably because of become of this. It's probably become of this ho hum boring old everyday life. Because I think they meant because. Yes. I'm looking for something with a little more stimulation, something rife with danger and intrigue. Listen, can I just be frank? <laughs> uh, or, or maybe Steve or Bill. The next blackened hasn't shown up yet, and I'm getting bored. So I've decided to come up with a new way to motivate you. But motivate? Is it another set of videos or something? Because I remember that one. I yeah. felt like I forgot about it, but I remembered. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to show us some demented thing to try and drive us all to murder? Oh, whoops. The battery. D yeah. Oh. I thought you said, oh, whoops. Like, oh, I gave him an idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. My bad. Drive you to murder? What a mean thing to say. Just awful. I mean, it's a great idea. I don't know what you've got planned, but we're not going to kill each other anymore. Starting... Now! <laughs> like, just stabs everyone. <laughs> hmm, that's a very big talk. Do your best to, black it up, to back it up, okay? Now then, with your permission, let me begin. So this time, it's... Embarrassing memories and secrets! As long as you're alive. It's a given that there's things you don't want other people to know about you. So I did a little investigating of my own, and I dug up some of your darkest secrets. Oh no! <laughs> Nagy! You like to pee in the sink! <gasps> no! <laughs> if someone said that to me, I'd be like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's like right up there where my dick is. It's save, saving water. Yeah, you just, you just do a little and then it's clean. I'm going to hand that <laughs> I mean, it smells a little bit afterwards, but it's whatever. As my uh, oh, as Monokuma <laughs> spoke, he tossed the envelopes at our feet. I quickly snatched the envelope with my name written on it. I nervously pulled out what was written inside, and my entire body suddenly went rigid. <laughs> Makoto wet the bed until he was in fifth grade. Oh, who cares? Yeah. What? <laughs> How'd you find out about this? Everyone started talking at once. You have 24 hours if someone doesn't become blackened by then. All your deepest, darkest, most embarrassing secrets will be exposed to the world. Oh, so because I don't want people to know that I peed in my bed once or a couple times, I'm gonna murder someone. Yeah, I'd rather not be known as a murderer. Yeah. Like, I, I feel like if you killed someone, that would immediately become your deepest, darkest secret. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll roll by a crowded intersection in a van strapped with loudspeakers and oh, spill the beans. Go, 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 go. I couldn't have murdered him, Your Honor. I was too busy peeing the bed. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I sure do wet the bed all the time. Every time. All the oh, time. Oh, God. All right, that's you, bud. <laughs> So, that's what you meant by motivate? Yep, you got it. They're all pretty unpleasant, trust me. None of you want to reveal that stuff, right? It's definitely something I'd rather people not know, but it's not really that big of a deal, to be honest. We never kill over something like that. What? What? What did you say? 
He's right. Your plan is doomed to fail. No one's gonna murder someone for this kind of thing. This is kind of oh, 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 no. Is it because, for better or worse, your memory is still a way to connect to the outside world? I have stuff I wouldn't want anyone to know no matter what, so I assumed you'd all be the same. Which is why I put so much effort into preparing this next motive. Man, you're saying you really won't kill each other over that stuff? That just sucks. Well, what can you do? All right, then in 24 hours, I'll expose all your secrets just to make myself feel a little better. So sad, so depressed, fair not well. <laughs> With an <laughs> He beansy bouncied out of the room. With an almost convincing look of depressed dejection on his face, Monokuma receded into the gym's depths. Oh, so he really does, like, just fall into the floor. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> I didn't know what to expect at first, but maybe we dodged a bullet on this um, one. I mean, yeah, having these secrets revealed is gonna be totally embarrassing. But that's seriously totally not dodged enough. a bullet until one of us gets shot with a bullet. <laughs> then it's like, oops, none of us dodged it. But that's seriously not enough to give someone a reason to kill, right? To Good news, everyone! I have a brilliant idea! Why don't we all just confess the secrets in those envelopes right here and now? If we do that, any and all motive for murder will vanish. That's pretty smart, right? <laughs> okay, so my embarrassing thing is... I don't want to hear your stupid st story! What? Besides, I don't... I don't I don't want to talk about it! I don't care what anyone says, I don't want to talk about mine! As for me... Neither do I. Not because it is unpleasant, but because it is impossible. Oh. What does that mean? Well, it's just human nature to want to hear it when you say it's impossible. Come on, it'll be good for you. <laughs> My secret is a fourth dimensional cube. Yeah. <laughs> I don't get that. <laughs> Absolutely not. Come on, come on. It's okay, just a little bit. Come on, come on, come on. As I said, here we go. Oh God, this guy! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on. <laughs> I said I don't want to talk about you. Have a better time, Lord. Kia. I agree with them. There's no need to discuss it. What do you think, Chichiro? Chihiro? Sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. I don't really talk. Want to talk about it right now? But, but I also don't want to leave things the way they are. So maybe I can talk about it later. After. Well, I thanks for clearing that up. <laughs> yeah. Um. No. After I try my best to become strong, then I can tell everyone. <laughs> if you don't want to talk, you don't have to. I'm not super excited to talk about it either. True. If everyone's that much against it, even if my bro's the one that suggested it, I gotta say no. <laughs> well, that's okay then. Alright, fuck me then, right? Yeah. Either way, if it's just a few secrets, I'm sure no one is about to kill anybody over it. I hope you're right. A secret so bad you'd kill someone to keep it. Nobody's got something like that, right? Okay, I'll stop with all the secret talk. But, it's just so you know, secret secrets hurt someone, secret secrets <laughs> tell no one! Each of us has 24 hours to get ready. Having our secrets exposed isn't going to be fun, but it's not like we're going to die because of it. That's right, Kiyotaka Ishimaru. Ooh. So, you know, um, don't do anything hasty. Like, kill someone. <laughs> <laughs> the way you keep repeating it kind of makes me worry even more. <laughs> oh, uh, okay, sorry. I know it's gonna be tough, but... Bing bong. Ding dong, bing bong! I gotta go, there's, there's the old ding dong, bing bong. <sighs> okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, it's ten, it's nighttime, the bed bugs. <laughs> Alright then. Nighttime already, huh? Okay, let's all call it a day, man. Let's all call it a day, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, let's jeez, call bro. It a day. It's like, whatever, you know? It's like, Turns out I'm a grifter, that's fine. <laughs> of course. Good idea, we need to prepare for tomorrow. I was left with an anxiety I just couldn't shake, but we left things as they were and left things as they lay. Okay, very poetic. <laughs> one by one, we headed back to our rooms, and one by one, we picked up our brooms. One by one, we went zoom, zoom, zoom. We pow powed our booms. <laughs> <laughs> Secrets and memories you don't want anyone to know about. A way to connect to the outside world. Honestly, all that crap Monokuma was spouting didn't have any effect on me. There's no way anyone would kill over stuff like that, at least. 
that's what I thought. But maybe Until I, I wet the be... bed and killed somebody. <laughs> yeah. I don't want anyone to know I pee! <laughs> <laughs> Which is probably why without too much of a struggle. Jeez, I'm more tired than usual. Super tired today. Woo, so tired. Must have been tired. all that peeing at night. <laughs> <laughs> I feel asleep. But what I didn't know is that even then a tragedy was taking place. A tragedy that we'll never know. We'll only Whoa. ever know next time on Game Grumps. But oh, well, we gotta finish the dream first. The Monokuma Theater. Hey, do you have a second? I want to confide in you. It's about the prevailing world attitude right now. Oh, yeah? The difference uh -huh. between passive and active, I mean. Oh, okay, yeah, that's the okay, thing that well. everyone's talking about. For example, it's the difference between like, oops, I killed him, and yeah, that's right, I killed him. Amazingly, there are tons of people who don't understand the difference. Can you believe it? But there's a huge difference between oops and that's right. You know what I'm saying, right? Anyone can kill someone in the heat of the moment, but surprisingly, few can do it with calculated intent. To make that choice, then put it into action, it's way harder than just letting your emotions lead you. It's all about preparation. Resolve. So maybe you're wondering, what's the point I'm trying to make? Well, I'm not totally sure myself. Maybe you should try reading between the lines. Oh. Reading what? between the lines. Got um, it. All right, next time on Game Bros. Yeah, next time on Game Bros. I am intrigued. What's the tragedy? The tra- the- the tra- tra- tragedy? What's the tragedy? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, bye everyone. Later! Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> ooh, ooh.